friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW or the Weight Watchers Blue Plan. Happy Wednesday, it's another what I eat in a day. Today we have a pretty fun day, we're working out, we're going shopping, we're teaching Palmer how to use the dog door so I'm really excited for today's video, not to mention all of the delicious food and a really good dinner recipe. So if you're excited for another what I eat in a day, give this video a big huge thumbs up and don't forget if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed to my channel I'd love to have you here hit the subscribe button and don't forget to ring the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video down in the description box you're going to find my nutrition coaching website where I do offer personalized to you macros and calories a lot of you have reached out and said that you've used the online calculators and they all give you different information that's because unfortunately they're not personal and tailored to you that's where I can come in and do those macros that fit you in exactly. You can find that on my nutrition coaching website along with 30 and 60 minute one-on-one -on -one sessions if you want just a little bit more individualized support. Links, discount codes to everything I shared with you today as well as all of my favorite things and my Facebook group. Head on over and join us there as well is all linked down in that description box. So we have a busy day today, lots of really good food, so let's jump in. We are got time and we're wasted. Got no pens for the night. I love how you look at me. Feeling low, nothing to lose. Can we stay here tonight? Cause I don't wanna go. I know the tension's gone now. And that you won't stay here. Keep looking back, don't wanna forget ya. Yeah, I wanna do it all. my breakfast you can see that I'm having some of my biscuits and gravy casserole that I made in meal prep this is phenomenal this serving is only four smart points which is not bad at all and then I just peeled a couple of really small kiwis and then of course I'm working on my water I have a coaching call here in about 20 minutes so I'm gonna eat some breakfast get on my coaching call and then we're actually headed out to Jazzercise I'm having my pre-workout before I go in. This is the My Adventure to Fit. It is 9.15 in the morning. I'm going to the 9.30 class. After class, I think we're going to go grab some Starbucks. I want to go to the Dollar Tree to see about getting some things for a, a video. And I'm just gonna take you guys with me throughout the day today. Once we get home, we're gonna start dinner for tonight. We've got a busy day. So first, I'm gonna go ahead and get my workout in for the day, have my pre-workout, and I'll see you guys after. One hour later. Alrighty, I'm a hot, sweaty mess, but my workout is done. 31 active minutes, which is amazing. So I'm gonna head over to Starbucks. I think I'm going to get something to eat because all I've had is that breakfast and it's already like 10.40. So I think I'm gonna do like an early lunch, late morning snack, and then we'll head on to the rest of our errands. Starting for you. Uh, can I get the grande iced chocolate almond milk shake and espresso? Sure. And then a spinach and feta wrap? You know, I'm so sorry. We're having some order issues and that's one of the items we are out of. Okay, well I'll just get the coffee then. So I guess I'm just having coffee. 
Oh, this one is so good, you guys. I don't normally get the brown sugar cinnamon anymore since I can make it at home, but this almond chocolate one is really good. I'm not as hungry as I thought I would be after Jazzercise, so I think this will tide me over until I can get home and actually have some real lunch. So I'm gonna head on in to the Dollar Tree and see what I can find. Yeah, so I keep pushing it wide. Hoping you'll survive my side. We can't get lost in time. But don't you wanna do it all again? Start to repeat in my mind. Dancing with you by my side. We can't get lost in time. The Dollar Tree was a success. Of course, I always buy more than I originally go there for. I did buy some frozen things for my video and then my favorite ice cream bars that I shared with you guys in my Dollar Tree snacks video. If you haven't seen that, I'll make sure I link it down below for you. I bought a few boxes of those and they're frozen. So I'm gonna go ahead and head home. I am getting a little bit hungry. It's 11.30, so it's about time for some lunch anyways. So I'm home and I'm going to get dinner going in the crock pot. So for part of dinner, we're doing homemade crock pot baked beans. So you're going to need a pound of a 96% extra lean ground beef, some vinegar, a can of Bush's baked beans. The vegetarian ones are the lowest calorie, lowest point. So I picked those ones up. A can of kidney beans, or I'm gonna use the tri-bean blend because this is what I have on hand. Brown sugar alternative of your choice. This is the Lakanto. As always, it will be linked down below with a discount code on the Lakanto website. You'll also need some liquid smoke and then some center cut bacon. Here's the center cut bacon. I just put it on a sheet pan. I went ahead and I'm going to cook up the entire pack, even though we only need 12 slices for the recipe. And then we're going to get our ground beef browning on the stove. I'm going to allow the ground beef to cook all the way through. You want it nice and browned. And by the time it finishes, our bacon should be about ready to come out of the oven. Into the slow cooker, we're going to add the entire can of the Bush's baked beans the drained and rinsed can of kidney beans, the browned and drained hamburger, your 12 pieces of crumbled or cut up bacon, one quarter cup of your brown sugar alternative, two tablespoons of liquid smoke, two tablespoons of vinegar, and I forgot to show you guys that you'll also need one cup of ketchup. I'm using the organic unsweetened from Primal Kitchen. Just make sure you're using a no sugar added ketchup to keep the points the same. We're going to stir this all together and then put it on to low heat for six to eight hours. Hey you, are you learning to go in and out of the dog door? Palmer, are you learning? Are you learning to go in and out of the dog door? Your eye and your sister. She's right there and he is eyeing her. He sure loves the sun. See, look how big I am. Look how big I'm getting. So here's today's lunch. I'm having my meal prep. This is my sticky sesame chicken and broccoli. I'm hungry from the gym, but I really feel like I need to bulk up some protein and veggies after my workout. So this is all that I'm going to have. If I end up grabbing something else, I'll definitely let you know, but this is my lunch along with another big cup of water. Hi, Lola. Lola, are you sunbathing, babe? Lola, are you sunbathing? Yeah, this is her favorite spot ever. So Palmer's learning to use the dog door. He can get out easy, but it's hard for him to get in from outside because it's a pretty big jump. So here he comes. Troy just taps the dog door and shows Palmer how to come out. So here he comes. Come on, you could do it. Do it, you could do it, buddy. Come on, good boy, good job. Good job, buddy. Come on, buddy. Palmer, come to mama. Come here, buddy. Come here. Oh, good job. Good job, buddy. Good job. Bud, your brother annoys you every day, huh? He just wants to play with you, Diesel. Diesel, play with your brother. Nah. <laughs> Palmer. It's 10 to 3. I'm going to have a quick snack. I'm having a pretty high point dinner, so I'm going to save up for that. But I am a little bit hungry, and I need to get in a little more protein today. So I'm going to have this Siggy's Simple Ingredient Yogurt. It has 14 grams of protein. It's coconut flavor. It's delicious. So this is going to be all I'm going to have for my afternoon snack. 
and I'm almost done with my gallon of water. 3.50 p.m. and I just poured my last glass of water from my gallon, so I'm going to have a sparkling water with dinner. Look how amazing our beans look. I'm gonna go ahead and get the rest of dinner ready while our beans simmer just a little bit longer in the crock pot. With our beans, I'm going to go ahead and just fry up in a pan these distel turkey franks these are delicious i got these in my imperfect foods order as always imperfect foods is down below with 20 dollars worth of free groceries when you sign up for a box no minimum order required so take your 20 dollars and go but i love imperfect foods as you know and these have been in my freezer for a bit so we decided that dogs and beans sound really good together and then i'm also going to steam up these organic california blend vegetables in my microwave we're not doing a bun we're just going to eat the hot dog as is here is my dinner so I have some of the vegetables of course that is zero points and let's go over the points of the baked beans the crock pot is divided into 12 servings and it is seven points on all plans for 112 which is a good size amount of green beans I would say about three quarters of a cup it's 193 calories so if you count calories this is fantastic 193 calories shouldn't be seven points, but it is. So that is seven points for that. And then these uncured turkey dogs are four points a piece. So my dinner is 11 points. And again, that's partially why I ate light the rest of the day because I really wanted to have a good amount of the beans and a turkey dog for dinner. And I forgot to tell you, I'm having my Ora Bora water. This is my treat for finishing my gallon of water. This is the peppermint watermelon. I love this. There's no natural flavors. It is so good. This is hands down my favorite flavor and I buy these off of the Thrive Market. So I'll link Thrive down below with 25% off of your first order and a free gift. If you're interested, I find them to have the biggest selection and the best price. Hello, frog dog. Look at your little back legs. Are you going to take a nap in the sun? Palmer, you going to take a nap in the sun? Oh, hi, Lola. Hi, Pumpkin. He's a good boy, Palmer. For dessert, I'm having one of my Trader Joe's chocolate chip cocoa meringues. You guys know I love these. This is the size of them for reference. They're perfect size. And one is enough for me. I'm not super hungry. That dinner was super filling. So that is dessert, and that is everything for today. So I keep pushing it wide. Thank you for joining me on another What I Eat in a Day on WW. I hope you enjoyed spending the day with me today. We had a very good, productive day with lots of really delicious food. Don't forget that that crock pot baked beans recipe is on my recipe website, which is down in the description box, along with nutrition coaching, links, discounts to my favorite things, and my Facebook group. We definitely love to have you join that community. Also, before you go, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell next to it so you don't miss any videos. And if you would, give this video a big huge thumbs up it really helps me out and lets YouTube know that these are the types of videos that I should be putting out so thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all next time bye